All right, so we're gonna do a review of this uh, Ryobi One Plus inflator slash deflator. Uh, so what you can use this for really, obviously is, uh, you could use this to air up your tires. I've already done this with my neighbor's tires. I aired up tires on there, and I'm sure that you're watching this and seeing reviews on people airing up their tires. But this also has an inflator right here as well. And so um, this inflator could be used for say air mattresses. You could use it for, uh, you know, like medicine, like not medicine balls, but the yoga balls. And we're going to do that today. We're going to show you, um, you know, how easy it is to uh, air up a, a yoga ball. And then uh, one of the cool things about this is that um, it doesn't come with, uh, I believe, the 18 volt battery. But I bought this one originally for, uh, you know, a leaf blower. And I didn't want to buy another battery because we all know how expensive they are. But this battery actually does fit for this inflator. So I thought that was really cool. So just a couple features. Uh, I'm sure you've already seen uh, the features on this. So over here on the on the side right here where the uh, the tube is, this is gonna be a tube, or uh, I'm sorry, a, kind of an inflator tube right here that you're going to go ahead and use. You're gonna screw this tip onto um, you know, your valve for your tire, and then you can go ahead and inflate it. This also has uh, some fixtures on here to where like maybe you want to um, I got to pull it out, but maybe you want to air up a soccer ball, ba a basketball, football, something like that. Comes with one of those and a couple of other little, uh, you know, tools and fixtures there that you got. But, uh, you know, but today what we're going to do is we're going to really use this for the inflator portion of this. So there are two different settings and two different modes on this that you can go ahead and use this for. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the tube off of this. And then what you see on the very top right here, this is where you're going to connect the actual tube itself. There's a couple of notches. I'm sure you can see right here. Oops, I'm sure you can see the notches right there. So the notches go on. Let's see, where are we here? Yeah, there we go. It's going, going to go right here. And of course, you can see there's a couple of notches that are on there. So we're going to go ahead and tie this on and twist it. And you just take this little tip off or you keep it on. So in this case and circumstance, we are going to inflate this ball. So this is a, a yoga ball that I have right now. My niece want, has been bugging me to go ahead and inflate it. So we're just going to go ahead and inflate it here. So it's going to be pretty simple. All right. There's two different sides and two different settings. Don't forgive me if the microphone is uh, right there. There's two different sides and two different settings. There's uh, one mode where you can go ahead and um, it will show 0.0, .0 right here and it's pointing to the tire. All right. So you could do that or you can press the the mode and I'm not sure if you can see it, but it's pointing to where you can inflate the actual, like say an air mattress or something like that. So what we're gonna do is that we're gonna connect this end right here. It's kind of hard to do on camera, but you know, we'll, we're gonna go ahead and do the best we can. We're gonna put this inside the actual ball itself and we're gonna try to inflate it and it shouldn't take any time. Uh, just so you know, like this ball came with like a hand pump so it takes forever to, to blow this ball up with a hand pump. This thing blows this thing up within like a minute or two. So we're gonna go ahead and press start and we're gonna go ahead and uh, inflate it. So it's kind of loud, but here we go. We're inflating. So yeah, there you go. So it is a perfectly inflated ball. We're gonna go ahead and put the stop in it so that we can go ahead and do that. And there we have an inflated ball. Okay, so one of the other cool features is that you can actually use this to deflate your air mattresses. So let's go ahead and deflate this, see how fast it will deflate the actual um, uh, ball itself. So again, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this off the, the top um, and then we are gonna actually take the, part that's got the notch and we're going to actually put it in on the end right here. There's an end right here and you're going to see, I'm not sure if you can kind of see, but it says inflate and deflate on both sides. So uh, it should be pretty, um, pretty simple and self-explanatory. So we're going to go ahead and put this on. And then what I'm going to do is I need to actually take this out. Um, I got a little tool here that's going to take out this little pin. Okay. So it's deflating. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do the same exact thing and I'm going to put that in there and we're going to put it on the mode and we're going to press start.
And the air is coming up from the top right here, so it's deflating it. So as you can see, it is deflating the actual ball itself. We're not going to deflate it all the way. I will say this. It does deflate just a little bit slower than uh, expected, than I thought it was, it was expected, but still does the job. And you have to also uh, consider the fact that when we were deflating it, that we were using this tip. And uh, of course, this tip doesn't allow a whole lot of air to come through. So that's just something that you got to consider. But if you're using, like, say, an air mattress, you might be able to connect this end in and it will deflate it a little bit faster. So that's just kind of a heads up as to um, using this particular uh, air compressor. Uh, I have used it uh, quite a few times, like I've said before. Uh, mainly, I have used it for my, uh, my neighbor and for myself when it comes down to inflating tires. Um, but yeah, a uh, good little tool to have in the house in case that you need it. So yeah, uh, I hope this review helps you out.